Hello everyone! Welcome back to my YouTube channel. Welcome to my YouTube channel if you're new. My name is Maria and we are talking about lichen sclerosis. I want to touch this really really sensitive topic for all of us who have lichen sclerosis in the genital area. Today's video topic is educative. It's about what to do if you can't have penetrative sex. Of course, when you affected area is just between labia minora and labia majora, it's not that painful to have sex. But when your vaginal entrance is involved, it makes things a lot harder. Like a bearer of this disease, I know what I'm talking about because the topic of relationship in my head is close. Lots of women don't know how to start a new relationship or how to proceed with the old one when you have this kind of trouble. Traditional sex with lichen sclerosis becomes not only painful, but torturous, especially when you have micro rings or ulcers on your vaginal entrance. So the first thing I have to tell you is you don't have to stop having sex. You don't have to stop having relationship and you don't have to stop yourself from having a relationship. With lichen sclerosis or not, you're still attractive and you still have to give your love, give your beauty, give your energy and take what you want. There are some other types of intimate closeness that you have to consider for yourself. And please don't be shy, it's the 21st century and love is everywhere and information is literally everywhere in every corner. So you can go to a bookshop, you can find some YouTube channel, you can go to a sexual education class or some kind of school or sexologist who will tell you what to do. So the first thing to consider is petting. Petting is considered to be sex with only hands and probably imagination. Like I said, there are a lot of books and illustrations or video channels that can tell you more about it, but just consider this option because it can bring you as much satisfaction as penetrative sex. The second, almost traditional way to have sex with lichen sclerosis is oral sex. Oral sex goes in two directions for two partners, so it can be very satisfying, very gratifying, and if you're new to this, like I said, you can resort to the help of every bit of information you can find about it. The third category of sex is the intimate closeness that involves some sex toys. This can be very stimulating and for example if you have a very very early stage of lichen sclerosis but you still feel the need for the longer foreplay or maybe more lubricant you can also use sex toys for this. If your stage is not so early I'm so sorry about that but still, you can use sex toys for non-penetrative sex and get your satisfaction. If you're still determined to have a penetrative sex having lichen sclerosis, there are some tips from the doctors that can help you. First tip, of course, is to use more lubrication. The more lubrication you use, the smoother the process will go. The second advice from the doctors is to use longer foreplay. The third advice from the doctors is to use a vaginal dilator. It's something that resembles some sex toys, but actually it's a medical purpose thing. It will help you to dilate your vaginal entrance which will make sex not that painful in the future. And of course, use something that will make your skin more elastic, like oils or rejuvenation gels or hyaluronic acid shots or whatever. But remember, don't use any oils before having sex because oils can damage the condom or react in an unpredictable way with your lubricant. In conclusion, I want to tell you, this is really hard to have lichen sclerosis. And of course, it's not easy to make this decision to proceed with your normal life, but in some intraditional ways. Especially when you love having it in a traditional way, but still you don't have to deprive yourself of your intimate life, of relationship, of some happiness and joy. And remember, you're not alone.
there are a lot of people who will understand and support you. Please let me know what you think in the comments down below this video. Thank you for watching this video. Please hit the subscribe button and the little bell button slightly to the right of it. See you in the next episode. Bye!